Okay, so let's take a look at my uh, my camp kitchen. Uh, the Coleman Company would be proud of me. I think I own one of everything. Let's walk through here and show it off. Of course, be more organized than this if I was actually out camping. But just give you an idea of what it takes to take uh, five grandkids camping for three days. This is kind of what it takes. Grill. I just got my new uh, Coleman uh, propane post. So I can hook all that up to one propane can. Oops. You see right there. And of course, you got to have a toaster and a coffee pot. I'm running my. Uh, my 12 volt refrigerator off my uh, Stanley Fat Max battery. Pretty cool, I think. So I can be 12 volt if I have to. Of course, when times are tough, there's nothing like having a Honda 2000 generator uh, to make things uh, more pleasant. And then, of course, here's my, uh, my house when we're camping. And then, for the grandkids, here's their tent. It's a Coleman 8-man. Put a couple of uh, sleeping pads in the middle, maybe a blow-up air mattress. There's plenty of comfort here for four kids. Moving on to the poor man, this will be for my uh, daughter and son-in-law. We <laughs> have a really nice arrow bed. Inflatable arrow bed we'll put in here for them. All they'll need is a dresser and a shower. I guess it'd be just like home. <laughs> or as close as you can get to camping. And then I'm thinking this one for my uh, granddaughter Jenna. Go for a nice cot and a comfy sleeping bag. I used this one for the palm the last two years. And it's actually a pretty good size for one person. I've always slept well in it. Okay, <laughs> that's a lot of camping stuff.